we are going to take a look at one of iMindMap's most popular features, 3D View. To get started, simply click on the 3D button at the top of your workspace. As you can see, your map has been transformed into a 3D object. You can use the 3D joystick in the corner to tilt the angle and view your map from all sides. You will also find that by clicking on any of your branches, you will automatically zoom in on that branch. You can navigate around your map by using your arrow keys to move from branch to branch. 3D view will pan over to whichever branch you currently have selected, making that your focus. You will notice there is a padlock at the bottom of the screen. This controls 3D auto zoom. If you click it so it appears locked, auto zoom will be disabled. You can then just manually control zoom by using the bar here or the wheel on your mouse. With 3D auto zoom disabled, you can see that selecting different branches prompts the view to pan over to the branch without zooming in. To make the most of 3D view, try our range of 3D environments. Simply hover over the cog icon in the corner, then environment, and this will reveal our full range for you to choose from. There are many different styles available, from grid rooms to sea and sky. 3D view is more than just a way of looking at your map. You can also create and edit maps just as you do in the normal two-dimensional mode. You will see if I hover over the end of a branch with my cursor that a 3D version of the branch target will appear, so I can draw branches or relationships just as in 2D mode. You can also insert links, notes, icons, new multi-maps and many other features in iMindMap. As well as the standard image library, you can also add 3D images from our special 3D library for an even stronger effect. And it's not just maps that look great in 3D view. Flowcharts look fantastic in 3D and can be added just the same as in 2D mode. You can exit 3D view at any time by simply clicking the My Map button at the top of the screen.